Hi, I'm James Beebe. I teach astronomy at Redland High School. I wanted to talk to you today a little bit about the solar eclipse. We've been hearing so much about it on the news, on social media. So the first thing I'd like to tell you is what an eclipse actually is. So the moon orbits around our Earth, and every once in a while, it'll come perfectly in between the sun and the Earth, blocking out the sun for a short period of time. That's a solar eclipse. Everybody's been making a really big deal out of it. So what is the big deal? In fact, a lot of people assume that solar eclipses are rare, but that couldn't be farther from the truth. In fact, solar eclipses happen about every year and a half. What is rare, however, is for so much of the United States to be able to see the full solar eclipse or in the path of totality, where you'll be able to see the eclipse 100%, the sun totally gone except a little bit of the outer ring. So that's what's rare. It's been a long time since it's happened last, and it'll be another seven years until it happens again. So viewing from Pennsylvania, you won't be able to see the full solar eclipse because we're not in the path of totality. However, you will be able to see about 70 or 80 percent of the eclipse. So the sky won't get totally dark, but you will see the moon slowly cross in front of the sun. That'll start a little bit after 1 p.m. It'll peak at about 3 p.m. and end at 4 on Monday, August 21st. So everybody's been asking me how to view the eclipse. Uh, we've seen lots of disclaimers and warnings all over the news. I will say this, be sure that if you buy eclipse glasses, and that's the only way to view the eclipse with your eyes, you buy them from authorized uh, sellers. So NASA has a link that we'll put below with those authorized sellers on them. So only buy glasses from those. They have to be approved, they have to be very, very dark. A lot of you might have welding helmets that you know are very dark, so you think, hey, I'm sure this will be safe. In fact, they're not. Uh, even most welding helmets aren't dark enough to safely view the eclipse. So thank you so much for listening. Um, I hope wherever you're viewing the eclipse from, whether here at Redland uh, or if you're traveling to the path of totality, you enjoy it and have a safe viewing experience. Thank you for watching. I look forward to the start of a new school year.